Hey everybody and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbeth. It is Monday, the beginning of the week and hopefully the beginning of a much better run after the last two episodes where I've really embarrassed myself. So, we were going to jump in and new run and I think what we're going to do today is try to unlock Lyft which you need to be greed mode with Azazel. Now, I've said before, Azazel is easy mode, as long as you don't sacrifice yourself. Um, and greed mode is something I don't have any experience with, and I only know a slight bit about. So this will be interesting. So let's let's take Azazel into greed mode and see if we can unlock Lilith. So I believe the whole thing about greed mode is, you hit this button, enemies spawn, you kill them, you get some money. Do that a few times, and then you can go down to the next floor and repeat. You can spend your money in the shops to buy items, and you have like these around here for other items. And the whole point is to get as much money as possible to donate at the end, once you beat the final boss. So you can hold, hold on to all your money if you want, but you can be weaker because you didn't buy anything. Or you can spend all your money, but not have as much to donate at the end, right? Little Steven here is not that good. He's got like a his little buddy that follows you around. He has psychic homing shots. I'm gonna leave him. Maybe somehow able to like d6 him or something. I think that's HP. And I think that's I think that's free HP. Like free entire red hearts from that. I think. Spider mod is new, that's apparently good. And we de oh Never mind. I'm going to say we want to buy a key. We don't need to buy a key because we can do that. Get a key. Very simple. And then just come straight to here. And the nails. Nice. So that's not going to change us from a laser beam. But it is going to increase its damage. So let's bring on the enemies, I guess. Hey. Nice and easy. Ah, yes. See the countdown in the center there? Every time that reaches zero, the next wave will spawn, regardless of whether you've killed the current wave or not. If you kill the current wave, it's nice, and it will spawn the next wave already, so you don't have to wait. That was stupid of me. Very stupid. See, what you woo may or may not realise about Azazel's laser is that it does take a few seconds to charge. So you can't just, like, fire it when you need to. Sometimes you have to let it charge, and if you let go early, you just don't fire anything. Which is why I screwed up and got shot, because I let go early and panicked and... Tried to... Oh! No! Uh, yeah, come up here. This will be really good, actually. I want you to blow up these pots. Oh, I missed. Completely missed. Get out of you. And you. And... Oh, these guys are not too difficult. Why am I avoiding the money? I have no idea why I'm avoiding the money. Didn't avoid the shots, though. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, yeah, let's pick up the money. Right, let's first of all, let's grab this. Because I think that's HP. Yeah. Oh, it's not free red hearts. It's just free hearts. So, uh, we could start donating a few hearts to this guy for a present. And then restore them with the hearts that are around. We don't have that many hearts around... So, is there anything else here we want? Possibly spider mod, which costs 15. Which we're not going to get. Are we going to risk our... Yeah, why not? We're risking it. We're going to take a bit of damage when we leave here. That wasn't worth it. So, we just get a... Take half a heart of damage. But, it, in the end, you know, maybe it was worth it. Ah, okay. So, uh, it's... I'm an idiot. It seems after fighting waves of enemies, you then have to fight waves of bosses. That's not so bad. Larry Jr. is ridiculously easy. Because he's segmented, he takes so much damage if you've got anything of piercing. Uh, let's grab this money. I think I can leave now? Yeah. So what happens if I push this? Now that I've... I don't know. Should we take spider... I haven't, I haven't used it because it's um, new. But he, he will tell you the HP of, it, of enemies, and I think if an enemy hits him, they get, like, paralyzed or something. I think give me that. I would have won. Didn't get anything from him. I could keep risking my health. But odds of getting anything from him are low. Right, so we're going to go down to the next floor then, I guess. Should we grab a little Steven? Bonk. 
So you'll see he'll shoot little purple dots that are homing on the enemies. I didn't know there was enemies in here. Cool, we can see how much damage we do as well. 88 per laser ridge. I nearly got hit. Nearly got hit. So if we can find BFF again like we did in the last Zazel run we did, it should increase little Steven and also Spider Mod. Right, so we want a key. What have we got in here? The pacifier. I think that's increased tier rate. So we should be able to shoot faster. Oh, we've also got smaller. Right, we want that key. We definitely want that. We'll get rid of that while we can. Right, we'll buy nothing. Because we might get... Can, can items drop, like chests and keys and stuff? So maybe we could get in there with a key from that. We're going to risk this again, by the way. A couple of bombs. That's nice. We could blow that up for a card, but we're not going to. We're going to take our damage. We're going to come out here. We're going to fight. Whoa. I panicked then and somehow didn't get hurt. Get rid of you. Oh, I hit the bunnies. I, I told you before, these are one of my worst enemies in the game. I'm so bad at avoiding why there are bombs everywhere. That was bull honky. Oh, oi, 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 oi. Get rid of these spawners. Don't want anything spawning in on my watch. We done? We good. Alright. Up. We're going to grab this. Sinfoil. Which is hit... No. Uh, damage and speed. Speed and shot speed. It wasn't Sinfoil. It was speedball. Sorry. Right. We definitely want to grab a key. So now we can see what's in here. Little horn. Actually, it's not that good of a familiar, but he is one of my favourites. So he will chase enemies around, and he can also fear them, which makes them run away from you in terror. Right, I don't really want anything else here, except maybe a key for the next floor. Uh, I'll take a key, and then we'll do this. Oh, freaking horn. I said a little haunt is a personal favourite little minion of mine, but haunt is absolutely... One of the worst things I hate fighting this as a boss. Luckily, he didn't do anything. <laughs> oh, chub. Oh, ah, why am I silly? Why am I silly? Charge his laser. Jeez. Right, he's being feared, so he's going to run away from me. And he's dead. Grab all this. And we are going to re-roll. With a bomb, I guess. Ooh. Now that's good. It's crap, but it's good in the long run. That doesn't do anything for us, I think. So we're going to take this. It's sp speed and range up. Which, speed is always handy, I guess, but we're already very fast. And range is not going to affect our laser beam in any noticeable way. But that's two out of three syringes. There are more than three. But if you get three of them you uh, get a transformation called Spun, which is an extra two points of damage. Two on the two max of damage, which will put us at maximum, according to this, which is uh, very inaccurate. Let's go down. A couple of flies, up to no good. Yeah. Grief mode doesn't seem that difficult. I've taken a lot of stupid damage because I'm a massive idiot. That's terrible, but I think we get five free bombs just by picking it up. Yeah. Safety pin is nice. Increased shot speed and range, I think. Yeah, and some evil up, which gives us a, a little black heart. Which we're going to risk by going in here. Oh, I didn't have a laser ready. Couple of blue hats. This room pays for itself. I'm going to pop these for some extra coins, maybe. There's one at least. Oh, one of my favourite items. The D100. Oh, it is very risky. Ah, uh, you know what? We are absolutely going to buy it. Absolutely going to buy the D100 as soon as we can afford it. Which should hopefully be very soon. Ah, oh, bunnies! If that is even your real name, I hate you so much. And then spiders that spawn more spiders, I hate as well. Actually, you know what? That shot speed increase is really helping me with my charge time. A lot more than I uh, expected. Get rid of you guys. Get rid of you guys. 
should be near the end. I should count how many waves there are, so I actually know. That was a new enemy. Apparently they split into the like super meat boy looking things. Bunnies, no! Oh, just demolishing our way through this stuff. Excellent, we're gonna take all of this. All this. We grabbed all that stuff going in here. Right, we're gonna buy this. Because it's my favourite item. Right, what this item does is a combination of all the dices. So you remember that D6 that would re-roll the item on the floor? It will do that. So this boom here will get re-rolled. It will also re-roll everything about us, as well as everything on the floor. Uh, so if we had any coins in here, which I guess we could do if we, like, blow this up maybe and blow this up too. We'll definitely take this because it's worth 10. Um, so if we re-roll, these coins will change into something else, possibly chests. Uh, this boom will change into another item, and all of our items will change, including all of our minions. So it'll be interesting to see what we get. Let's re-roll. Right, we've got spun. So that is the thing I told you about, where if you have three different uh, syringes. We don't have those syringes anymore, because they've been re-rolled, but we managed to get another one, which totals the three anyway. Uh, they tend to hearts. We got an extra red heart up at the top. Look, we're very slow. We've got some other minions here. We've got a Gemini, and there's something behind Gemini. I think it's maybe Rune Bag. There is a way to check. Hang on. We've got a oh, Mystery Bag. We've got Gemini. We've got Leo. We've got oh, we've got the uh, the Sives. I can't remember the name of. We've got Loki's horns in combination with the Sives. And also, uh, Shielded Tears. It's a shame, because that's not going to work, because we have a laser beam. Which is... Blue? Why is it blue? I have no idea. So, randomly, we're going to shoot four laser beams out at some point. There we go, look. And we'll take this as well, which is uh, extra pill room. So, we'll use this pill. Infested. And we'll get another pill. Infested. We also re-rolled all the stuff on the floor, so we'll grab that. Ooh, cut hanger's going to be good. This item is a favourite of mine as well, because every time you get hit, you randomly drop an item that you can pick up. I'm just going to spend all my money on this, I think. A bit of extra HP. There we go. Just help me out. Right, uh, let's see how fights go. Oh, it seems we're weaker. We don't have spider mod anymore to tell us our damage, but... Clearly not doing as much... That guy, I can't read the cage. It's so weird going from being so fast to now being so slow. Crap. It's really messing with my evasion tactics. That's right, cool, we'll pick this up. Are there any batteries around actually? No, it's a shame. If we had a battery, what we could do is pick that up. And then we could just re-roll again. See, the thing about D100 is you can keep using it again and again and again. So you can completely change everything about yourself. Constantly. Which is, you know, pretty good. Alright, we don't have any keys. Is there any for sale? There... Oh, there's a battery. And there is a key. Good. Take that. Come on, grab it. There we go. We're going to come around and down here. We're going here... Spectral Buddy is not very good. Matchstick is a, a few free bombs, I think. And Evil Up. I don't really want any of them. Let's have a look in here. Oh, I don't have any keys. Great. Take some damage, leave in. I'm going to buy that, go back in. <laughs> Open that. Guppy's Head is a very good item. Uh, but I'd rather have the D100. Take another heart of damage, leaving. Alright, here's what's going to happen. We are going to fight this wave. Crap. In fact, you know, getting hit a bunch doesn't matter. We're probably going to end up, because of the way the D100 works, it's very likely that we're going to hit maximum hit HP at some point anyway. I'm doing really badly. Like, more than just being careless here. This is just bad plays. Right, we're going to D100 now and see what we get. We got conjoined, which is a, a transformation of having certain amounts of uh, little minion guys with you. Ah, uh, come on, we're very slow. 
And it's quite tricky trying to wipe out the, these guys before the waves come. My goodness, how do we avoid all that and then not avoid that? I don't know. Right. Oh, crap. Got all this stuff blasting around. We've also got one of my most hated items, which is Bob's brain. Using that is very likely... Oh, we have Kessler Tower, I think. We're dead. Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry. That was... I think it was the case of the Tower that did, I didn't realise until too late then. Right, that's going to do it for this Monday. Uh, tune in tomorrow. We're going to try it again. D100. I love it. It messed with me. I wasn't expecting to die so easily towards the end. No. I'm going to get better at this, I promise. For now, though. Goodbye.